On today's episode of Mummy's Boy, we've all got a secret task to find a traitor. Who my least favourite traitor was. Why my best mate was spaghetti carbonara. I, I ended up meeting superstar Shaggy. Remember to like and subscribe so you never miss an episode. It's Mummy's Boy. Hello, welcome to Mummy's Boy with me, Arthur Hill, and my adorable and traitorous mother, oh. Lisa. Say hello, Mum. Deep down, I've always been a mummy's boy at heart. And in this weekly podcast, I get to spend some quality time with mum and receive some much needed advice that only a mother can give. But sometimes my mum needs help too. TikTok, social media, viral videos, celebrities. These are all things which my mum just can't get her head around. Poor old cow. So I'm here to help her before this modern world leaves her behind. Yes. Not only will I help her unravel the mysteries of youth and bring her into the digital age, but I'll also be making Lisa's motherly... Ah! Oh! Always, oh always the lisp. Lisa's motherly wisdom available to all of you as well. This is really Every worrying. Time. So if you are in need of advice or even just have a question or story that you are desperate for Arthur's mum to read, slide into our DMs on socials at Mummy's Boy Pod or send us a message or even... A voice note. We love those. To WhatsApp on 07822 013837. And no matter what the issue, I will ask her in a feature I like to call Mum, Can We Talk? God, yes. Welcome back. Oh, thanks. We're here. I like your lipstick today. Oh. Seems like a statement. Is this after your, is this after the colouring? <laughs> the colours. I had my colours done, as you all know. Nice. And the first thing she said was, <laughs> you've got to wear a zingy lipstick. And I was like, no, no, mm. no, I always wear pastel. And um, she put this on and I went, absolutely not, not wearing that hideous. Right. But all the others said, yeah, it looks great. So yeah, I I'm think you should listen to your gut, I think. Oh, fuck off, Arthur. <laughs> <sighs> That's so rude. Yeah. What do you think, Producer Jack? Do you? You're just saying she's that. got a gun. <laughs> all the camera listeners, all the audio <laughs> listeners, she just held a gun up. Um, <laughs> oh yeah, sorry, audio listeners. Yeah, mum's wearing bright lipstick and bright Very nails. Bright. Yes, um, look at my nails. Yeah, matching really, or not quite? Are they? They're really not matching. Yeah, see, <laughs> I'm gonna keep my. Yeah, they look really. Anyway, you look lovely. Yeah, you look lovely. Um, wow, I've taken I've taken a neuro gum. This isn't a thing. Oh yes, but I feel like it's hitting me. Don't Honestly, be I feel wired off my brain. Do you? Off my head. I'm off my bloody head. Are you? Um, it's not that sausage roll. <laughs> but anyway, we've got some guests today. We we've have. Got some guests today. We have. But um, I wondered if you wanted to introduce them today. Ah, oh, yes. Right. With okay. an improv. With an improv. Speech. Speech. Oh my yeah. good lord! Right. Okay. So, um, very exciting. You were them. Have we had them before. Not that they identify as them, but they. No, we've yeah. not had no, them but before. <laughs> we've only, there are two, yeah. Yeah. two guests, two guests today, dear listener, um, and I'm terribly excited to welcome these two here because I'm a great, great fan of a television programme that they appeared in called dun, 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 The Traitors. Ooh. <laughs> and, um, I mean, who could it possibly be that would fit with this dynamic of a mother and son? I mean, I can't think. who else could it be, Arthur? You simply can't think. I can't think. Because he's never seen it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's I just have. get that out there. Um, yes, you have. Um so, Sorry. with <laughs> great applause... the audio listeners just Arthur's weeing quickly. just weeing quickly into his glass. Thank you. Can you stop now? Yep. With great aplomb and great excitement, I would like to welcome Ross and Diane! <laughs> welcome, welcome! Hello, 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 hello. Hello, hello. 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 That was the, one of the best entrances. Is that we've one of the ever had. Uh, really? Yeah, right. absolutely. You made a silly noise. Yeah. You did yeah. make a very, yeah. very strange yes. noise. Yes. Well, he knows that's why. Oh, this is exciting. It feels like we're having a sort of son versus mother situation. Mm. It does yeah. a little bit. It does a little well, bit. Well, I don't think it's supposed to be like that. No, it no, is. It and is. we know who is would it? win anyway if it was. Mm. Well, yeah, I think in we what, do. In what? A, a physical fight or? No, no, no. Just no. I would say absolutely battered. I think if that was the case. Yeah, like a tag yeah. team sort of. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you just go in with a very yeah. mysterial, I'll come mm. in with a choke slam. Maybe Perfect. this could be the future of influencer <laughs> boxing as well. Oh, good Lord. Son versus mum. Mm. Mm. No. No. 
So, um, I'm very excited, but I am a little. I've got to say, I'm a little bit scared. Why? Because, uh, because you're both very. Um, you are both very clever people, and tactical. Were you were watching the right show. <laughs> yeah, no, I absolutely was watching the right show. She was obviously watching me. And no, I don't think well, yeah, especially you. It has yeah. to be said. Thank you, especially you. Um, but. I, can I ask a question before we go any further mm -hmm. about the traitors, which bothered me all the way through? I only I didn't see the first two episodes, so I only came on on episode three. But um, I want to know where you all sleep. How in a bed. Are you to say? <laughs> well, yes, you might not be able we to say. You're NDA obviously not up to our eyeballs. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, but but you can boring. find it on the internet because it's been leaked. Yeah, just but not by Google us. that. Oh, yeah. really? And it yeah. will quote, it will qu it will, oh, in quotations, damn. Diane Carson said, No, we it sleep. wasn't Diane Carson it said a thing. No. no. We're that in the castle. So We're annoying. in the castle. You're We're so up at the not. top. Yeah, we are. We You're are. So we are. Not. It's just, it's everything that Big Brother wanted to be where they don't have the cameras in the bedroom. And, you know. Oh, okay. It's like finding Fair out enough. Bear Grylls like, gets hotels. Mm. In the evenings. Yes, mm. he lights that Can't fire that and still. then he leaves it there. And he doesn't. He does. He does. Yeah, I was such a big Bear Grylls guy. Uh, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> posters of him. Was he your hero? <laughs> yeah, just like oh. lamp on. And yeah. Then, yeah, and then bear grills. Bear grills. Yeah. yeah. Well, they missed oh. out the task where we just yeah. all started pissing on each other because yeah, of jellyfish things yeah, and yeah. stuff. Didn't oh, they? of course. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They missed that bit out. That, they they, they skipped that one. Skip yeah, that so one. it's quite close yeah. to bear grills actually. Mm. Oh. I'm here at the Ritz Hotel. Is that what it sounds like? That wasn't my best. I thought I'd give it a go. I thought it was. Yeah, I have no enough. idea what fair he enough. sounds like. Cut oh, I'm that thinking of that's because I'm thinking of the other bloke. I thought he's just like, just piss on it, just piss on it, whatever, it, like whatever <laughs> well, happens. Well, not memory, thank you. No, he does. Like, he just pisses no, on everything. That's what it. Bear Grylls does. That was, does yeah, it? That was yeah, does it? Yeah. That's his thing. Just yeah. whatever. That and books yeah, in he, the hotels. Yeah. Mm. yeah, yeah. He does the bits in the day. He eats his insects and then he goes and has a nice dinner. Slap up meal. Yeah, slap up meal. Oh well, that's rubbish, isn't it? Yeah. Oh. Terrible. Well, that's very different to you. Very different. You Slightly. sleep in the castle. Yeah. And and another really big moment for me was obviously your you getting in the coffin, which mm -hmm. was, you know, big for everybody. But because I work in the funeral industry, um, it was particularly exciting for me because I was watching and thinking, oh, you You're know. You're rubbing your hands together. We've like, got another how, one. <laughs> how close to reality is this? And it was it was very exciting. Yeah, I mean, the, we I keep, it, we keep being asked, you know, what was Ross traumatised? Was I traumatised? Oh, no, I'm sure you were No, weren't. not really. No, it, was was like, it was perfect Like props. Yeah. It yeah. was perfect for you. It was perfect for, perfect for yeah. me. <laughs> it was I'm so ignoring good. I was him. thinking the time has come. Finally. Well, he yeah. didn't want you to see him wiping away the tear. I had, to, I had, to, keep it, I keep, had mm. to keep it held back just because otherwise mm. people would be like, why, did, why does Ross really love the fact Diane's just That she's died? just been shoved I'd be there with the... Trying to find the lid of the coffin. Yeah. Thank you, Arthur. Well, Claudia. And then yeah. Shovel. Oh, yeah. 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 He'd yeah. be yeah. banging yeah. it yeah. shut yeah. with yeah. a hammer. Well, you saw mm. how Claudia did it. She just slammed, slammed it, it shut. Yeah, yeah. Because this it. one was continuing to speak, even while in the coffin. <laughs> so Claudia's like, let's just shut her up. <laughs> <laughs> she did my job for me. Yeah, it was good. It was oh. good. It was mm. great. Not everybody could have been put in the coffin. Some of the guys no. were quite claustrophobic. Absolutely. Mm. And would have been really, would have really traumatized. Struggled. Yeah. Yeah, would yeah, I'm Would you? I'm would you are you claustrophobic? Um, I am quite claustrophobic. But I because I don't know, because it was a game, mm. I suppose you do know that there is going to be somebody there who can help out if something horrendous. Oh yeah, I mean there were all the crew around within seconds. So, you know, yeah. I think yeah, I think I'd have been all right. Mm. I think I'd have been all right. <laughs> what about creepy crawlies? You like? You yeah, like that's what I was just, I'm, I'm just not, thinking that yeah, because I, I think I'd be crawlies. fine with being in a short, in a small space. Do you? But, but what, if what, there's a spider in the worms and the spiders, yeah, there's and worms, that, fine. Getting, worms, you know, fine. worms fine, worms fine, worms fine. I'm the same, mate. Oh, What's yeah. happened to worms? Spiders. Have we spoken about that before? Because I had a conversation. Maybe it wasn't on this. What, Where have all the worms gone? When was the last time you saw a worm? I see them in my garden. Oh, yeah, shit. me too. Yeah. 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 Where are all the London worms? Oh, the well, London we worms. We don't have gardens in London, know. do we? Yeah, yeah maybe that's it. it. But I just suddenly thought, I used to, I used to see loads of worms. And now Did you, darling? All... <laughs> God, Make your sure life has this changed. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh. Same with goldfish. 
gold. What? And I now thought you it was goldfish a trend. When I, I went around people's houses, that I, there'd always guaranteed be a goldfish. But now, your age, well, now it's darling. all French bulldogs, you yeah, know, darling, and then East <laughs> London things. Kids, <laughs> nobody has a goldfish anymore, yeah. darling. You know? I'm sure, surely people with small children still have goldfish. I don't know. Is don't that, do you win them at like fairs? But I don't think they do. do they, have they finally realised that no, putting them in a plastic they bag? Do they not? Oh, no. Yeah, well, it's a bit inhumane, yeah. isn't it? Probably yeah. virtual yeah. friends bag. now. Yeah, the plastic exactly. bag is not good. Virtual Pets. goldfish. Yeah. 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 Or maybe people just love Nemo too much and, oh, that's a clownfish. That's not even a goldfish. No, but, not. you know, it's a fish yeah. thing. It's a fish thing. We, loved, we had a lovely fish, didn't we, that we won at the fair and he lived for about eight years. Peter the fish. I thought you were lying about that. I thought you just kept replacing him. No, absolutely him. not. Eight years is Eight pretty years bonkers. for a goldfish that we won mm. at a fair. Well, I had a wow. fish called Ruby, and I got out of bed when I was about eight years old, ready to get the skull, and it was lying flat oh. on the bowl, and I got upset. My mum said, I'll look after it, which is strange, because mum wasn't very <laughs> maternal. And I came back home at, after school, and the fish, I kid you not, was jumping in and out of the little bowl that she'd put it in. I went, oh, oh my goodness, what have you done, mummy? She put brandy in with it. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> no, it's true. No, no, no. It Did lived another she? Yeah, yeah, it lived another six years until I put it in a tank <laughs> with what a whole a load of fish. fish. Very wow. happy, happy oh, fish. And I've got an even funnier story about oh, goldfish. Go on, then. When wow, I was a youth worker, Sarah coming. Johnson's goldfish was struggling, so her mum gave it the kiss of life. No, and halfway stop. through, she began to giggle, and she giggled so much she <gasps> sucked the sucked fish in. in and got stuck <laughs> in her throat. So she had to have that manoeuvre, what's that called, oh, beginning with the F, to get the, the, the fish, fish out. back yeah. out, and it survived as well. Wow. That's a true wow. story. <laughs> That's wow. brilliant. Yeah, I've yeah, got yeah. a similar story. Oh, right? here we go. Oh, Basically, come on, my friend had a PlayStation, right? P and he PlayStation the three. No, 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 no. Then I was sick on the PlayStation. Oh. And that PlayStation uh, lived longer than any of uh, our other friendship groups' PlayStations because my sick because was. Because I sick swear to God, gave it, it extra sustenance. Like five more years. All our ones packed in, and my vomit had had kept that alive. So very similar story. Oh, I think. That's, that's really incredible. not nice. It, but similar though. How old were you when you were vomiting on this like PlayStation? D, maybe. Oh, okay. Something like that. I <laughs> think yeah. you. Like it was like last week. I think, I think yeah, you nice. were the child that kicked a tub of um, yogurt down the back of our TV, and oh. it was buggered, and that was it. It did not oh, survive no, the yogurt. Really? A tub. Yep. So the yeah. Yeah. It was just sitting there, and you kicked it, and it just went right down the back of the TV. You know when oh. TVs were a bit deeper. I kicked it as in like I. Did I'd you try being sick on it? it to fix it? Yeah. Well, whatever. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's what I do. That's, that's, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Call an electrician. Right? Bit like Bear Grylls. That's, that's, yeah. that's, 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 that's the bit they blew it out of the traitors. I thought, Mum, you know, Claudia was about to close the coffin. I'm like, wait, wait, wait. I think I can get her back to life. Shut it down. Now that. And now why do you think she's still alive? Yeah. To be fair. That would have been worse than being in the car. Yeah. Mm. It's mummy's boy. Right, now, oh, sorry. Diane. Mm -hmm. oh. If anyone who's not watched Series 2 of The Traitors, and let's be honest, if you haven't already, and this is a spoiler, then it's your own fault. And we yes. have just been speaking about it for yeah, the last that's five very minutes. that's true, actually. You get poisoned by one mm -hmm. of the traitors after they receive a secret task to eliminate one of the faithful. So we thought it would be fun if we have a secret task each to complete during mm. today's episode. Oh. But with a twist. Oh. There's always a twist on the Mummy's Boy pod. Yes, There indeed. isn't, actually. This is the first one we've done. <laughs> um, we are each going to be given an envelope or a folded piece of paper. We didn't have the budget for an envelope. <laughs> with a secret task to complete before the end of this episode. Oh, God. But only one of us is going to be a traitor whose challenge is to pretend they had a secret task all along. Ooh. Oh, God. It's all going to be too At the end of the episode, brain. we'll decide as a group which one of us, which one of us, which one of us, which one of us, something always creeps in, which one of us has been making up having a secret task to complete all along and decide who the traitor is. Oh, God. Oh, my God. This is intense. Now, I don't know what's in any of these. Producer Jack has decided who the traitor is going to be, what the other tasks are. I'm going to hand them out privately now. Am I? No. Are you? No, no okay. producer Jack's going to hand them out privately. Thank oh, you. my God. Thanks, producer Jack. Thank Can you. we read them now? Thank Can you. we read them so now? We keep them secretly. secretly. Read them. Secretly. Okay. Oh, they're typed and everything. <laughs> oh. Everyone, forget about that. Yeah. Yes. Okay, forgot. That never happened, it. except Gone. it did. And you have to remember your task. If you have one. Yes. My God. Thank you, Arthur. Um, so, <laughs> Ross, are you a mummy's boy? Mm, 
I don't think so. No, no. not really. Oh, not really. Not? I think we just figured out this morning that like we bicker a lot. Oh, we do really you? do, don't we? I don't agree with we that. Do. I think <laughs> we do. Oh, yes. we go. <laughs> I think you proved the point, actually. <laughs> I don't think so. Yeah, we pick it. No, I am a mummy's boy. I really am a mummy's boy. But we, you know, we get in our little arguments and our little tiffs and our little moments, don't we? But that's okay. Yeah, of course it is. We have yeah, tiffs. We, I mean, oh, don't we? Well, we I, we do. Tiffs where else? E by gum. Mm. Sorry, we always have to do some accents. <laughs> yes. They're always dreadful. But that sounded dead. really sweet and pleasant, though. That sounded like such a moment. Have you any Did other it? children? Uh, yes, Arthur is a twin. Oh, right. Okay. So he yes. has a twin sister, Charlotte. Okay. Who do you bicker with more? Ooh, good mm, question, Diane. That is a good question. I would I'd probably say that I bicker more with Charlotte, but that's probably because Charlotte lives yes! at home. Yes! That doesn't mean that I like you Great more. answer, mother. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> uh, so that I probably do bicker with her more. But she's much nicer than Arthur. She mm. is. That, that definitely is true. That is true, isn't and it? And you see her more often. And I do so see her. Yeah, so, fair. you know, we're living together. Mm. So she's under my feet and doesn't tidy mm. her room. And mm. That oh. sort of thing. Is she older? Is she? She is, no, she's old she, twins. I'm two minutes. Oh, wow. I'm two minutes older. Two minutes yeah. older. There's a lot of wisdom. Was that fun? I, I bet that, that was fun. In that two minute gap. What, for me? No, yeah. not for you. Just for like growing up with a twin. Like, oh. I just, I'd love to, oh, I'd love I, to be a twin. Yeah, Does no. she look like you? Um, no. No, not no. at all. No. No. Because um, you look like your mum. Do I? I think so. Yeah. See, yeah. people yeah, say, yeah, yeah. Yeah. everyone says different things. Like, then so I'd have to meet your dad, but yeah, yeah. yeah. definitely, uh, yeah. I think you Normally, look like your dad mom. is like six foot four and huge, so I didn't get much of that. No. Um, but your twin on the other but, hand. Six foot twin. three, <laughs> rugby <laughs> player. <laughs> yeah. <It's enormous>. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. She does look more like her daddy. Yeah, but I don't She's think we, we look alike at all, my, me and my sister, no. And we're def we're so different. It's quite weird. It is quite weird. For a womb mate, as I like to say. A womb mate. Womb mate. Yes. <laughs> Bless. Of womb yes. 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 I remember that. And yes. how many of you are there? There's three of us. Three that, of you. That I grew up three with. Siblings. And then we've got a, a stepsister uh, and another half sister, my little sister, Caitlin, who I only met two years ago. So. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. So, yeah, exciting. Aww. Yeah. And not, but you're all living separately now because yeah. you're all old enough to be living well, separately. Just about. Yeah. Yeah. And are you just still about. in Ireland? No, I've been oh, in England not... since 99. Oh, have you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, why did I think you yeah. were still in Ireland? Ross came over when he was five. five? I think, yeah, mm -hmm. five, yeah. Oh, yeah. okay. Hence why I don't have the accent, but all my other siblings, mm. they sound a bit more Irish than me. This one... Do they? Like, uh, you probably think that mum sounds really Irish, but she I'm... She does. But I, but I think you're so neutral. Like bit, <laughs> really? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Not, not, not Irish. Obviously, you still sound Irish, but like then we go over and you're sitting, my auntie and, and like cousins and stuff. They're, they're like, going to be much broader. Really well, like, it's not so much that they're faster. I've had to slow down when I came over to England because um, I'm mm, not going to be understood and no. quit the swearing because Irish people swear more. Not offensively, oh, it's just part of just my yeah, talk, just, they So do. I've had to yeah. knock that in the head, really. Mm. Oh. So My favourite yeah. video on the internet ever is an Irish guy. Who's saying like get the bad? No, good luck but getting frostbite. You seen that guy? <laughs> no, I've not seen that. <laughs> he's like it's a snow day in his school and he's like twelve, but he speaks like a forty-year-old. <laughs> oh, good luck not to get frostbite, and he keeps just saying it. <laughs> I've never seen yeah. that. It was a wintry walk to school in Port Village, but they're a hardy breed in these parts. Well, the demolishers, we had to go anyway. We hadn't much a choice in the matter, but sure. It's a cool, it's a cool journey to school this morning. Oh, good, you wouldn't belong getting frost, but... No, it's really funny. Well, that would no, be I've a southern Irish accent. Yeah. That would be softer than mine. Right, yeah. And now oh. he's... now he's. I, he, I got him... Someone interviewed him recently, and he's, like, grown up, he has a massive beard and hair, and he's like an auctioneer. No, he's really fast. Oh, I bet he's good, yeah. Oh. 40, 40, 40, 45, 50. That kind of yes. Thing. Yeah, I've never uh, been to a sorry about the accent. I don't. Worry. I thought you were going to. So, uh, have you yeah. seen the video yeah. that's uh, that where there's two old men trying to get the bat, and he's got Derry, Derry, get the bat, get the bat, get the bat, Derry, <laughs> catch him, catch him, Derry, Derry, catch him, Mom, will you get out, Derry, will you catch him? Oh, fuck it, oh, oh, huh, oh. oh. catch him, Derry, catch him, catch him, Derry. Bigger towel, that's it. Get him now, quick. Get him. Oh, fuck it. God, Daddy. Oh. 
Marie, will you stop looking in the door? Oh, jeez. Catch him, Daddy. Catch him. And there's just a bat just flying around, and he's just oh, going. Oh, that's sort of a bat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, like no, a no, not a bat. bat. Well, oh, maybe. But maybe they're getting a bat to get the bat. Oh, my word. Oh, double there's battage. Level, there's double battage levels to this stuff. Yeah, Could be double battage. Get the bat, get the bat. It's so <gasps> good. Have you no, seen that one? I haven't seen it. No. No, you no. don't really do internet, do you, Mum? No. Oh, do you mm. not? No. no. Well, neither did, oh. neither did my mum well, until... Well, no, nor did I. I my Instagram accounts ways. run by my daughter, Annie. But my oh, daughter keeps me lovely, right. The oh, daughter, is that, that, love, that the lovely Lisa? Yeah, 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 she oh, keeps lovely, me yeah. right. Yeah. I'm not very internet savvy. Mm. Mm -hmm. Well, things can change. Do you think that might change? Mum made her first TikTok all by herself the other day. It's not Actually, you didn't, did you? I didn't. It was Charlotte. Yeah. You had him put though. You did. You know, oh well, it was me doing some... it. Oh, okay. But you can post stories now, it. though. Can That's I? That's pretty good. Yeah, Did you've I? done a couple stories. Have I? I think so. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, on tick. On, in oh, on Instagram. Oh, on Instagram, I can yeah. do those. Yeah. Yeah, I can do those. I haven't worked out TikTok at all. No. No. Mm. Who has? Well, I don't, mm. it's very complicated. Do you it, it, do no, TikTok? No, 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 no. I do have one after the traitors. I made yeah. one, and it's just me basically re-watching myself with a can of Fosters in my hand, just getting pissed. <laughs> just okay. And just, just narrating on it. And that's it, that's it. And then I get like, you know, 13 year old girls going, that looks great. I'm going, does it? <laughs> it's kind of weird, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, 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 mm. really kind of weird, yeah. Can. So yeah. I, I yeah. yeah, I don't really do TikTok. I do, you know, Instagram and all that kind of stuff, but I just, I don't know, I can't get my head around it. No. My job is almost to like know what, what's going on. Like I do, mm. um, like I make uh, adverts and stuff. So like, you know, marketing ah. agencies, things like that. I should know okay. what to do, but I don't. But you don't. I don't. There's too many buttons, too many things. There are. And they're all different. They're all different. They're all different. different. all those buttons. I know. So many buttons. There's so many oh, buttons. Oh, I don't like it. I'm like, I'm on the cut. I'm, I'm 29. So I'm like, I feel like I'm mm. just, I was just too old for the TikTok mm. era. So I just oh, stick okay. to my ways with Instagram think? and and all that kind I'm of stuff. I'm definitely too old for the TikTok era. Then <laughs> oh, you sound like you're getting into it though. It's just a number. Oh, Whereas like mum, so mum's got Facebook and and <laughs> oh, no, I stumbled I'm on across Facebook it. Because... I stumbled across it the other day and you've changed your name on it. Oh, what you call Diane Forrest? No, Who's I she? was <laughs> Diane Forrest. <laughs> Well, no, I only Why? started Facebook because Why? it was, was the way like to get information from my running group. But oh, I didn't befriend anybody. The person that set it up was my friend. That was it. So when people applied to be my friend, I ignored it. And I was so called Di right. because I can be bothered with people trying to follow me. Yeah. And I like running through forests because this is years, oh. you know, this is ages ago. <laughs> That's so, mental. Yeah. But I use it for that. <laughs> Instagram is now very different. My life's very different. So yes, mm. and I'm I was called Diane. Well, no, I did go on Instagram to follow Ross, and my um, stepdaughter does skincare, natural skincare. So I wanted to follow oh, them. Okay. So I went on Instagram, and I was Diane, aka Mum, because I always wanted to be a mum. And then, of course, I'm now the mother of the nation or whatever. So um, it's like no, mental. I don't know. I think you've yeah. got a contender and here. Though. I have. Yeah, there's a couple of you. But I had five followers. Good, uh, solid. Lisa, no, Ross, <laughs> Sophie, my friend, Jenny, and I don't know who else followed me. Then I posted oh. um, some run results that I was pleased with. Right. I got five more followers, and I was like, oh. what's all this about? Ooh. These people don't even know me. And now, since Traders, it's gone a bit mental. Yeah, Which I mean, is all very imagine. flattering and very lovely. Mm. I but, unfollowed uh, you, to be fair. Yeah, thank you. Oh, charming. Because <laughs> I knew it wasn't you. It's Lisa, isn't it? It's not us, you know. Well, that's a good point. Mm, yeah, she needs a No, God, no, no, I've got... And you. also... And you kept tagging me and stuff, and it was just doing my head in. <laughs> that's you, Lisa. <laughs> so I just unfollowed. <laughs> so how... Ha so actually, life-changing. Yeah. Is it like... Has it been... Uh, it obviously has been life-changing. Do you think it will be life-changing for a long time or do you think it's a moment in time that you're going to really enjoy but actually would like to go back to normal life if that's not too I deep? think it depends on um what happens through the year mm -hmm. you know not yeah. um some of us have been given amazing opportunities which yeah. have been fabulous and also have been doing some work for charity Great. Arthur and I were doing sorry 
Ross and I who were doing. Yeah, who are you? Um, yeah. you are I, don't know. I don't know, Mum, who am I? Oh, I don't know, I don't know yeah. these people. Yeah. Oh, who sorry. The hell we were are these doing, two? Um, you know, we've done some charity work. We're also going to be at Crystal Palace at the weekend, oh, um, nice. trying to prevent, it's about preventing knife crime in London. Oh, wow. If you can get to do things like that, oh, that's wow. amazing. Gorgeous. You know, so that's, um, yeah, that's great. Um, been on a couple of shows, but we're very tied up into contract as well because we're not really supposed to be on shows and things, TV shows. But we Aren't all you? signed these. No, we're all, all signed these sort of unknown, really, you know, what yeah. was going yeah, to happen. Yeah, of course. Um, oh, obviously, oh. me and mum are sort of getting used to working together. Mm. Um, did you guys struggle to work together in a sense? Sure. Uh, in the show or sort of, after? Yeah, just sort of b both, I guess. Uh, in was the it? show... No, yeah. we were on. Well, <laughs> oh, that went well. No, well, we did really because you know, in the grand scheme of things, we both had uh, completely different opinions on who we thought was mm. who. We didn't um, agree on anything. No, we were like no, arguing that's true. when we had the short, like, little bit of time that we had to kind of chat amongst each other. We were just arguing the whole Cause time. Because the first like, day, <laughs> he's so, the first day like, you whispered to me. He said, "I think it's Harry," and I went, "No, it's not. It's Anthony." And of course, we neither of us agreed, but you were right. Gosh. But he didn't yeah. pursue right, that, yeah. But didn't when he, he when I was asked if one of my children me. would like to go on, and um, I thought he was most likely to have a bit more time than the other two, so I rang him and he said, I'm not going on that with you. He said, I don't want to be told what to do on national TV in front of everybody. <laughs> I said, Good don't point. worry, exactly I'll be telling what everybody what to do. Exactly it what will happened. just be you. So <laughs> that is she what just happened. told me off, like constantly told me mm. off. Oh. But I think in, you know, the grand scheme of things, that's why, you know, the nation kind of were drawn to us because mm. oh. people can just see that, right? Like their mums tell them off and yeah. it's a great, you kind of have to take it. It's a great it. notion. Yeah. And then, you know, I got the odd little thing in here and there which was, you know, it was hard to do, especially when you're trying to maintain a secret relationship or whatever. I do, oh, Roasting I the old roast dinners and whatnot, so. I don't well, know Yeah, was it hard to it. not call her mum as well? Because I not would definitely really, slip honestly. up. I, yeah, I think. No, yeah. I think because basically, because Lisa. you're like so in the Lisa. game and Lisa. there's um, the adrenaline's going yeah. and whatnot. Yeah, it, the only thing was, was he kept fine. doing it too much. He kept going, Diane, and he wouldn't even <laughs> say Diane. <laughs> It doesn't Diane. roll off the tongue very easily. <laughs> so Dan, now I have to say So, it. for example, I've met you now, Ross. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Arthur, sorry, Arthur, right. I've met you now. So yeah. I wouldn't keep saying, Arthur, now I have a glass of water. Mm. Arthur, what does that yeah. say there? Arthur, yeah. I like your jumper. I might you. mention your name One. once. But that's what You're he kept training doing. Yourself, right? Yeah, I was. It was, was, like a, was like a young Jedi. Diane, do you want just, just yeah. training. How funny. What I've realised is your name sounds like two names. It's I, honestly every time I was saying I was going Diane, I was going. It's like two names, isn't it? Like Di and Anne. Mm. Because I've never seen. Because I've never said it before. I was Holy like shit. when I was saying it, I was going Diane. I was going why? Di I was saying, I don't but know. He kept lowering. He was Diane. And, right. and eventually we got and I said, will yeah. you knock that on the head? That's mental. Doing that. Diane. Oh, they're off. Lisa. Lisa. Oh, that's no. lovely. Yeah, that's all it. No. Lovely Lisa singing. Anne. Lisa Ann. Oh, Diane. Uh, no. No. Doesn't work. But we got away oh, with no. it mainly because Zach thought Paul was my son. And that then, was, the, that you know, was quite funny. Well, therefore, we were covered. We were, yeah. you know, that it was, was fine. There was, and there was that one, I do remember the one moment when that, oh, I can't remember exactly what happened. And everyone was talking about it and Paul was, Paul was saying, you know, oh, I think they think she's, I'm her son mm -hmm. and everything. And I was just looking at your face, just thinking, how the hell I was laughing. can I was, you? And I, I, I would buzzing. so want to have poked him in the eye at that point. No, no. Oh, perfect. I really, no, God, he was perfect. such a pain in the arse. <laughs> he was a pain in the Sorry. arse, although I, lo I actually loved him Did on you? the show. Yeah, I thought he was a great guy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. really didn't like it's him. It's funny. He's I'm not funny. to say that. Sorry. He's, he is funny on the show. Mm. Nah. <laughs> it's mummy's boy. Right, it's time for the nation's second, second favourite, favourite game. game. Um, two lies and a truth. Hurrah! Um, and this week they're all about our guests from the traitors. Yes. Which of the following statements about Ross and Diane is true? Is it A, Mum? Mm. Ross and Diane appeared on another TV show a few years ago. Ooh. B. Ross and Diane ran a marathon together in 2022. See, Ross and Diane have completed two Tough Mudders together. 
you know what a tough mudder Two is? Two what? Tough mudders. What's a tough mudder? Um, like a cool way to say a cool mum. No, tough mudder is no. an extreme... <laughs> She's a tough mudder. ...obstacle course. Oh. They're advertised online. Yeah. Yeah. Are they? And you have to crawl through mud. Yep, yeah, you have to crawl through mud. George is doing a, a marathon of tough mudders next month, actually, which is mm. bonkers. A marathon? A marathon? Yeah. yeah. That's mental. Good so yeah. one of those is true. Yeah. Yes. No, and one you, of those you know. is a lie. Two of them are true. Two yeah. of them are no. true. One is a lie. Two of them are true. Two of them are true. Mm-hmm. So this isn't the nation's favourite game. Of oh, no. Two Sorry, we were, Two truths. Yeah. And a, and a lie. One yeah. lie. <laughs> you, can, you never know what's coming. Oh, my God. <laughs> now I'm really confused. Okay. So oh. join us in part two. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we'll find out the oh. answer. And we'll also be reading your Mum Can We Talk correspondence. Oh, hurrah. See you in part two. Yes, absolutely. It's Mummy's Boy. Welcome back. <laughs> wow, the tension is palpable. Uh, before the break, we were playing not two truths. No, we were playing two... No, we were playing yeah, two, two truths, truths and, and a lie. lie. Two truths and a lie. Come on, Ross, <laughs> get... Oh, <laughs> oh, I'm really worried about a slate last night. It's those cocktails no, I, think, this one, I think there's something it? fishy no, going on. Really something, something very, something very fishy, fishy going on. Fishy going What's on? happened? You haven't given her one of those little chewing gums that you had earlier. No, I gave her mushrooms, oh, yeah. though. Oh, I don't like mushrooms. That would be it. Of the jazzy kind, you might. No. No? Ooh. no. Not the jazzy can? Can't even hold a glass of fizz, as you'll find out. I'm not going to touch those either. <laughs> Come on. Mushrooms aren't fizzy, to be fair. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm just a hardcore smack then. I mean, no, sorry, what? Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> right, before the break. Yes. We've said that. Right, these were the options of the questions. The, the, the two lies, two truths and a lie. Fuck. <laughs> Ross and Diane appeared on another TV show a few years ago. Yeah. B, Ross and Diane ran a marathon together in 2022. C, Ross and Diane. Ross and Diane have <laughs> <laughs> completed two tough mudders together. Oh, God. Okay. So. It's been ages since we got one of these. I'm yeah, it really has been Ross ages since we've got anything right. Um, so are these two, two truths and a lie? Mm-hmm. Really? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You, I think we just sh- got to clarify one of them. No. Sh- yeah, yeah, just oh. one. <laughs> what are we thinking? Okay, I'm thinking. I like the idea of the tough mudders. Never heard mm. of it. Um, I reckon they might have done that. Okay. That's one truth. All righty. And I've got to pick another truth. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You just pick the lie. Which one is the lie? Thanks, producer, Thanks Jack. producer Jack. I think the I don't think you've been on a television program before. What if it's like a they appeared in the audience of Graham Norton or something? Mm. You oh. ever think of that? Well, no, I didn't think of that because I don't yeah. think outside the box. Do I? We could no. have had a brief stint on. You know, they actually met on they met on Love Island. <laughs> Sweet babies or Love Island. Oh, or Love yeah. Island. It yeah. could have been Too either of those. Shows. Yes. Very similar. Um, no, I'm sticking with what I've so said. So the lie is they appeared at a TV show a few years ago. Yes. Okay, Ross or Diane or Ross and Diane in unison, please reveal which is the lie. <laughs> 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 you know, I don't think first. this is a visual first. podcast. Lovely gentlemen. We Ladies. did not complete a marathon, oh. and we completed a half marathon, not a full oh. marathon. In oh, that's sneaky! I was. What TV show have we been on? You can say the one when I was a little baby. Family of the week. Yeah. On <laughs> the big breakfast. Family of the I, week. Honestly, in the I, big I was breakfast. listening to those. So your industry you were plans. A yeah, we are, we are, we are. In Gabby Roslin's yeah, arms. I remember that now. Yeah, but as you were doing that, oh. I was going, I think mum's fucked up here and said marathon instead of half marathon. So I was thinking, oh, we're going to have to clarify. We were on the, the big marathon. breakfast for a week with Gabby Roslin and Mark Little. In, for a week? In, yeah, that's how they used to, it was years ago. They used to bring in Family yeah. Day. Like, they do. It wasn't a lot. Yeah, okay. um, it wasn't great. It was just after New Year's Eve. Um, and what they were, year was this? Well, it was the, you were a year old, so 95. God. Chris, 
No, if you were born in Christmas 94. <laughs> you loved yeah. it. It, you loved it, I loved Ross. It, I loved it. No, yeah. do you know what? It was it was January '96. That's when we she were on. She was priming me Great for year. the traitors. She was. That's exactly what she, she was, was doing. Yeah, mm. yeah. 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 She was it's been your plan all along. Mm. But so I'm she I'm, was, I'm confused by the fact you can be on it for a week straight. Yeah. So you yeah. so it's basically um, they put you up in the house and they used to bring in this family to appear Monday to Friday and right. you'd get to do activities that you like to do. You get to meet um, <laughs> guest stars. We met Shaggy, Gary Rhodes. <laughs> Is it called Shaggy? Yeah. Yeah, and Gummy some obnoxious Shaggy. rapper, Scooby. and I've forgotten his name. He was Shaggy. He was a singer. He was a nice singer. He was nice. Singer. He was nice. But he was a nice oh, guy. Yeah. He was just a nice guy. Jan Leeming had a birthday oh. party, I think. Was Jan, Jan Leeming? Leeming. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Who's well, that? it is it's a while ago. They won't know who it's Jan Leeming your time. is. Right, right. Newsreader. But they just come to your house. No, no, we we went over to London and they put us up. Oh, and you just get entertained in this house for a week. Yeah. That's and we did that when I was so one years Shaggy old. But it say, doesn't matter. That is the truth. You and I were on a TV show together. There you go, you see. Not a few years That's ago, though. I was not one yeah. year the old. Your mother, she's she's not your hands <laughs> full with like three kids and that, but you still had time to go on to a... Yeah, what a, did you do a, with the other two? You know, we're all to on. London. We oh, were all, all on. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. is oh. Shaggy performing in front of in your living room at eight a.m.? This is what I'm. Co- no, because we were in London. Picture this: we were both butt naked. <laughs> and this is a one-year-old. And then, kid. and then they did a travelling <laughs> road show. Uh, they used to go to different towns, and they rang me up and said, "Would your dad like to go on it?" So my dad went on the wow. travelling road show the next year down in our town in Ireland. They um, it was, Dine, came to us, like and Dad told a joke. It was an old age oh. pensioners talent show. Oh, bless him. But you know what? It was a bit of a fix because dad told a joke, which wasn't great, I have to say. I did give him advice. And do you know he had finished it? He actually finished it and nobody laughed. There were hundreds and thousands. So I jumped up screaming. It was about putting your washing out, but I can't remember what it was. (laughs) It was not good. I screamed and yelled and everybody laughed. And another man sang like Al Jolson. And then the mayoress came on with an Alsatian. She played a piano, sang the dog was supposed to sing with her bark <laughs> there was not one bark came out of that dog's oh, mouth no. and she <laughs> won no because oh, she was the mayoress that was a fix isn't that poor that is, really yes. and that was on the back of us being on a TV show Dad got on that <laughs> wow mind you it How wasn't much of a talent it? contest it was, was it it was wow. Wow. Yeah. 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 it's a long time ago it's really funny there's a legacy there yeah definitely and Terry Wogan Mm, same, yeah, same same level is he dead sorry yeah. R.I.P yes don't Terry Woe gone too soon um, Arthur right <laughs> we've we've got some questions <laughs> he had not he fantastic. gone right he on wouldn't time, have minded that yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, he was yeah. a nice Terry chat Terry was. Was. He was, no, a yeah. was he Welsh or Irish no he was Irish, Irish. But I was getting well, confused him and Ken Welsh, Burns so. that was sort of who Ken Burns the guy also does radio who sounds a bit like Terry Wogan I think Ken he who? also just retired. Ken something. Ken Bruce. Ken Bruce. He doesn't sound anything like Terry Wogan. He does a bit, doesn't he? No, he's, he's not Welsh, Irish. He's Welsh, though. No, he's not Welsh. No, I know. Oh, okay. What's the matter with sort of, you? Yeah. yeah. He's not, Scottish. Oh, he's Scottish. <laughs> there you go. I'm not saying they're similar, but I'm saying they have a similar tone of sort of wise old man. I'm just a trying vibe. To a <laughs> similar yeah. vibe. vibe. Yeah. Oh, That's okay. what you mean. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. Yeah. Um, <laughs> right. You were close. Are we ready? It really wasn't. Are we ready to move on, please? Um, for some mum, can we talk? Oh, God, I'm not sure if I am. Um, if you don't know, guys, this is just where we get listeners and uh, watchers to send in. It can be questions, uh, embarrassing stories. They mm. apparently come, sometimes want advice from us. Um, mm. It doesn't often ever go it's too well, but worrying you can itself. impart your wisdom here. We yes. need it. We need we it. We do need yeah, it. Yeah, we need it. Um, question one is from. Nix. Nix? N-Y-X. Okay. Oh, right. okay. I've never seen that before. No, me neither. Hello, Arthur, Lisa, Ross and Diane. Hello. I have a fun and embarrassing stormy, stormy story that my mum just loves to embarrass me with. Oh. Wow. Two embarrasses in one sentence. We're in for a cracker oh, come here. Come on, Arthur. When I was 18, I went on my first work night out. As the newbie, everyone was very generous and bought me plenty of drinks. As you can imagine, this resulted in me getting incredibly drunk. Mm. When I got home, I was barely able to stand and was was escorted right into bed. 
Oh. Now, I have no memory of the next part, but was informed of the following events the next morning. Mm. My mum woke up in the early hours of the morning to find me in the upstairs hall sitting on the laundry basket, having mistaken it for a toilet. Oh, no. She helped me to the bathroom and then sent me back to bed. Unfortunately, in my drunken state, I had weed all over the laundry um, and left a lovely mess for me to sort out in the morning. Yes. I did clean it up, of course, but oh. it's now a never-ending source of both laughs and embarrassment. Oh. So my question is, oh. what is the most worst embarrassing thing Arthur or Ross has done after coming <gasps> home drunk? Oh. Well, <laughs> I have video evidence. Oh. oh. Go, Diane. She Pull does. it up. She does. She does. Pull it up. It's the worst thing ever. So I came, I took the wrong turn in coming home from Liverpool. So it was really late in the morning, came in about half one, two o'clock. And um, I was driving, so obviously sober. And my key went in the door and he flew downstairs. Mum, are you okay? What's wrong? Why have you been so late? And he would never do that. would never mm -hmm. have cared if I was late. No, come on. So, sure, um, oh. Isn't that true? I always want to know you're safe. Yeah. Uh, so uh, anyway, <laughs> I, and I just knew then you know, that was something was up. So yes. I followed him upstairs and he was gotten to bed and he just went, Z -Z 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 -Z. <laughs> he made those noises. And I said, what's going on here? Ross, and he continued on. So I decided that what I would do is um, go downstairs and make myself a cup of coffee and just let him go on with it. Came downstairs. Decaf. There were, pardon? Decaf coffee? No, this is, no, oh, these oh, are the oh, days of absolute Calvin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And shots. there were empty bottles of beer lying all over the floor. There were beer stains on the floor. He oh. was 15. There were beer stains up the wall on the ceiling. We had a really high-pitched roof. Oh. Uh, there were beer bottle lids, so I decided I would video him, so I went up and quizzed him. And it sort of went something like, um, first of all, he just said Z, 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 Z again. Then I said, so, did you have a party tonight, Ross? No. Well, how come there's beer in the in the kitchen? Well, I did. I didn't have a party. I had two people in. You had two people in. I never said that, Mum. Okay, so oh. how many did you have in? I had 20 in. So you had 20 people in. I never said oh, that, Mum. no. And wow. then it continued on for about half an hour. And uh, I said to him at the end of all this, I'm going to show you this video in the morning. So we sat and we watched it and his jaw That's was great. on the floor. Oh my God. Absolutely. Story, okay, oh, well, you tell that. Well, I don't know how much well, you want like, me to she, tell. She was like, um, she was like uh, so who, who did you have? And it goes on for like half an hour. I'm just, I'm, I'm just not kidding you. I'm just making stuff. <laughs> I like, you can just see in my eyes, I'm just like just losing calm. it. I can't even remember like a sentence, no. the sentence I've said prior. And then she's like, who did you have? And I'm going, uh, yeah, so I had like Dan, had my mate Elliot, had Alex, um, spaghetti carbonara, David, <laughs> Rachel. And then mum just goes, wait, what? what? Did you say spaghetti carbonara? I'm going, no, no. That's what I had for dinner. No, but I did. I fully <laughs> said spaghetti carbonara was my mate. Oh, <laughs> was just a, and one of your best morning, mates. My Italian mate. Next morning I'm watching this back and she's like thinking that I'm all embarrassed and I'm just howling, <laughs> like howling at The myself. whole family have sat so crying good. with laughter oh, at this video. So good. good idea to watch yeah. Yeah, video and give them evidence of it. Yeah, Absolutely. Mm. It was bullying, I'd say. No, I don't think yeah. so. No, it's you, very you But you know that girl who's face. just, was it a girl that's just weed on a laundry basket? I Is don't it know. Nick's? Nick's. Well, Nick's, Nick's we're not sure. But yeah. I, I honestly, I used to hang around with these lads. Uh, in fact, in fact, I met one of my husbands in this this group. Being and the um, yeah. he's yeah. what they'd had a night and I can't I can't quite remember the details, but basically there was a Stephen and a David and David in the night. They're all absolutely hammered. Was Stephen. No, no. <laughs> Stephen pooed on David. Oh, right on him. on him in the night time and when asked why he said he thought David was a toilet <laughs> <laughs> Serious, oh, that David. is a true I mean, story. So weeing is nothing. Yeah, weeing is nothing. I'd forgotten that story Pood. until I've just heard that one from That's one of your listeners. Wild. Bringing something back to you. Yeah, which I hadn't so, wished hadn't which come back. That didn't is true, to, though. Yeah, there you go. Be reminded wow. of. So don't be embarrassed by the old no, wee in a laundry right. basket. Yeah. That's the old fine. Everyone wee in a laundry basket. Yeah. It's a rite of passage. For some. Is it? Yeah. I've never done anything like that. I believe so, anyway. very dull. Ah, oh, right, question two yes. from Zoe. Hi, Arthur, Lisa, Ross and Diane. I have a rather awful dilemma. Oh, oh no. no. I've recently moved out of my parents and into a house with my boyfriend. Oh. The other day I was rooting through my underwear drawer and found a pair of crotchless black underwear I've never seen before oh, in my life. Oh, no, no. 
Feeling perplexed and, to be honest, rather suspicious, mm. I asked my boyfriend about them. Oh. He was at first insistent that they must have been mine as the set of drawers came from my old house and he'd never been in said set of drawers, which were all valid points. He then took it upon himself to sniff the underwear oh. as he was so insistent they were mine, which was a little bit odd, but he seemed confident about it. However, right after he sniffed them, I realised my mum used to do my washing when I lived with her and sometimes she would get items of clothing mixed up. She also recently began dating again and oh. having male friends over. No. The crotchless black underwear that my boyfriend had sniffed could very well belong to my own dear mother. I feel a bit sick. My God. My dilemma is... I always forget that there's <laughs> following... My dilemma is, do I ask my 60-year-old mother if she owns crotchless underwear so I can confirm my boyfriend is just a mum panty sniffer and not a cheater? <laughs> and how would I even ask her about it? Please oh. help me. Oh dear. Maybe just sneak a pair of her mum's pants um, in her mum's house and ask her boyfriend to smell them and see if there's the same scent. Oh, <laughs> Diane. Sneaky. Does that not work? Right there with it. Yeah. yeah. Would that work? I've, well, I've, no, I've never been in this dilemma. I don't know. Oh, I should hope also, not. Also, what is a crotchless pant? Yeah, what is a crotch? I don't really know. It's got a hole in it. It's just got in a the hole front. in the. Well, yeah, I don't really well it could. Yeah, but you know. why? From like where? Like wear and tear? Or what? No. Like, it's their easy purpose entry. for easy, you know, entry. how's your father? But why even wear pants? Why even wear pants so then? Well, it well, keeps your bottom you warm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. I have no idea, so I've yes. not uh, felt yeah, the need. Yeah, neither should you both not have an no, idea of what mm. that is. No, because we're so old that we could never... Exa That's because exactly. we're their mothers. Boys That's don't like to think yeah. of their mothers mm. in that we way. We just don't Behave really get yeah. it. Yeah. I would... Exactly. Um, I would um, do you know what? what I'd just speak, speak to mum. I would just show them yeah. to the mum and just yeah. say, oh, mum, I found these, these in my drawer. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. yeah. yeah. just and be, and be very casual you know, about casual. it. Sorry, mum, uh, these must have been mixed up by mistake. And she'll probably go, oh, my God. Yeah. Surely she'd be more careful. Yeah. You'd be more careful, wouldn't you? I think you might. Putting a pair of crotchless... Crotchless... Well, not she wasn't wearing her glasses. I mean, I, you know, I've is that, got... Is that um, mentioned? Well, <laughs> yeah, but it's true, though. Yeah. She's not been wearing yes. her glasses. She, she might, might just have mixed them up them. and no noticed them yet. But also, would you rather your boyfriend was cheating or would you rather, like, he'd sniffed your, <laughs> your, your mum's crotchless mm. knickers? <laughs> Well, he did it by mistake. Yeah. And the word to honour when he did it. It would have been a lot worse if... You, he enjoyed it, I think. No, you don't know that oh, at yeah. all. I don't think I, I could hear that. I think he's looking for some comfort. I think, I think, I think, comfort. I think he's sleeping with the mother. Oh, he no. might be. I no. think, yeah, that, that's right, boys, that's that a load of nonsense. I'm going to tell you that's now, feasible. the mum wasn't wearing her glasses, didn't sort out the laundry properly. That's it. End of, OK? And she should be bloody proud she's got a mother that's still active, 60-something. So there you go. Mm. Couldn't but, just but be not, run clubs, could it? Though. Yeah. Couldn't just be what? Be active, stay active with run clubs, not crotchless. Oh, well, yes, yes. In run, run clubs. clubs. Yeah, no, yeah, why yeah. should you not be active in all aspects of your life? Age doesn't well, define you. You can do what you want until whatever age. Well, mm, that's all. Well, then be more careful no, with your underwear. Bollocks, boys. Is my point there. <laughs> yeah. I'm all. Ha I'm fine with you being active at. 60, well, thank be you. More careful thank with, you. So that's be, okay. We've got careful, his. Be careful um, where you put the underwear. Be careful where we. Okay. Yeah. Just right. keep our yeah. underwear. Because some mums lose their hidden. keys, some mums lose their marbles, other mm. mums just <laughs> lose, lose their, their underwear. Just, actually, every yeah, so. girlfriend I have, I end up sniffing her parents' underwear. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Every time. And it's always the same thing you've said. And it's always the, the mother's put, fault. Yeah. My eighth girlfriend now. Why are you sniffing knickers anyway? Um, Because. Uh, to, for this exact situation it happens more than you think I'm sure it's happened to you a lot I think yeah. Arthur you might have wrote yeah. this one in and called mm. yourself Zoe yeah Zoe? Zo. is Zo. it not Zoe? Zoe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's mummy's boy it is time for us now hmm. to decide who the traitor is in this among us oh, good amongst good. us among us da -da 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 -da. We were all given, well, three of us were given a task. One yeah. of us was given nothing, but had to pretend they had a task. Um, yes. And I have been looking out, and I, I'm pretty clueless. I don't know if anyone I've got thinks, one idea. Yes, yeah, say, we'll start with you, Mum. What oh. are your thoughts and feelings? I'm thinking perhaps that Diane 
is the traitor in our midst at this point. Why? Because much though it was highly amusing that you kept calling my son Ross and your son mm. Arthur. You know, I worry That's about this sort of thing, one, mixing up words. Uh, mm. She does have but an alibi. Do you she, really? she does. She actually does. But that's still a good one, though. Okay. That was mm. my thought. But okay. she's never done it to but people that she doesn't know. She'll do it to, like, me, and then she'll call me Michael or Jock or all the men in our family. Do you know what I mean? Yes. She doesn't but, do it yes. to people who she's right. only but just... You think, oh, she, you think Diane's made yeah. up that task herself? You don't think she was given that? I think she was given... Oh, hang on. Oh, you yeah, because it's... Really see, there's this. layers here. There's there layers. layers, aren't An there? absolute layer cake on this one. Diane, who do you think... Is the traitor? Um, I have absolutely <laughs> no idea. I was going to say Lisa, but now I'm not so sure. So I'm mm. going to say Ross. Oh, Arthur. Oh, see that <laughs> till the very I mean, end. Yeah. The very I'm, not, end. I'm not sure anymore. I don't know what to think. Ross, who do you think the traitor is? Much like the game, I've got absolutely no <laughs> idea. But you made a really good point, Lisa. So if this was the actual round table, I think you've swayed me. Swayed? Oh, really? Swain. Swayed. 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 You've swayed me to, to think mum there, actually. Especially now you just did it again. Oh. Yeah. Like, but then what's oh, the get then benefit then of her doing it again? Oh, Surely. I, could, I couldn't I see anyone else do anything that, yeah. like, out of the ordinary. No. No. You played with your rings a bit, but I feel oh, like that's just the thing. Thing, just thing I do. Anyway. I think you. Now I've noticed in the last half of this podcast that you were touching your face a lot, and you don't do that normally. Mm. I don't Very think. Mysterious. So maybe you were told to touch your face. Oh. But I also think it is you, Diane. So it's time we all revealed our tasks that we were given. Okay. Um, we all think it's Diane that is the traitor, but let's just read Bearing out. Bearing in mind, Diane's always a faithful. Yes, always oh, faithful yeah. to the end. Yeah, that's yeah. what a traitor um, would say, mother. Right, well, uh, my task was, without getting caught, use as many different accents as you can. Oh! Which I think I did okay you used I kept them brief. No, I did Irish. I did Australian at one point. Did you? Yes. I did American. Um, really? German. 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 <laughs> yeah. Kept yes. them so, on lock. Yes. Yeah. They're okay. all just so. You I'm know, so used to you doing so them, realistic but... sounding that you didn't even notice. I didn't know. Mm. I no, thought they were just to... bloody awful to attack <laughs> their accents. Wow. Well, they didn't say that well they had to be any good. Thank no. you. Yeah. Thank I didn't you. even notice. It's quite offensive. There you actually. go. Mm. No, I'm no. well done. Thank you. Thank I'm you, a bit embarrassed now about reading mine. Go on then, Mum. Read yours. Stroke your beard. Without getting caught, use as many different slang words as you can. Uh, I don't think I use one. Use any. <laughs> I literally you know, have been rubbish. You, I've literally you... been sitting here going. Did you not? No. I can't I think, think of that's any. That's why she's touching literally. her face. Yeah. She's getting nervous because yeah. she can't really think of any slang words. Yeah. Think of any. That was rubbish. That is utter rubbish. I did you not I'm ashamed. Any. I feel like you did. I did. How's your oh, father? But that's not. Is that that's slang? Not slang. <laughs> <laughs> At least she tried. What, like, sort of. young kind of kids do you ever... Yeah, bunda. I thought bunda. of Bunda oh. in the middle of something, but I couldn't think of a way of getting Bunda in without me just suddenly going... You don't going, need to, you just, bunda. Said, just say it. Yeah, you just well, that'd be it. weird, wouldn't it? Then we you'd all got it. think... And this whole conversation hasn't yeah, been exactly. right. <laughs> wow. So I really do apologise. Oh. Yeah, right. So me and Mum, well, I did my task. Mum, Mum had a task, didn't do didn't it. Didn't do it. Which means one of you, would you believe it, from the show The Traitors... <gasps> Is a traitor. a traitor. So I'm not the traitor, but Ross is. <gasps> hey! <Whoa. laughs> Lovely little wink there. <laughs> Come on. Wow. But what would what did you do then? Uh, I, my whole thing was I was going to just ask for more and more water, but I only got it in once. Oh. <laughs> I got it in once, and then and then oh my God, you're and then a genius. It, that it, was because it felt like it was not part awful. of the show. Everything just went silent. And like, yeah, yeah, all right, we'll get Ross. Right. And I still had half a glass as well. And I was going, oh, they're just going to think I'm fucking weird now, aren't they? <laughs> I thought you were weirder oh, actually, because wow. I did notice you had all that water, well, and then not yeah. Enough, well, you only did it. Wow. I did it loads of times though. Well, I can't just keep asking for work. Well, that's just that, but that was the whole thing. Oh, that's really to. funny. Oh, I want to go on the actual there. traitors now. Mm. You should, I think fun. everybody you should go on it. Yeah. Honestly. Oh, no. So out of your comfort oh, zone. It's exciting. That's really good. Um, I don't do accents anymore. 
No, you don't need to do mm. them anymore. I will say, I think me and Diane committed to the bit more. Yeah, than I think so. Yeah, I agree. I'm just going to yeah. put well, that no, out Ross there. Ross really committed well, to it. Yeah, it was you me. did yeah. have made yeah. a good point, Ross. Oh, sorry. Oh, oh, oh she's, she's, she's so on it. Time. <laughs> she's always she's so on Not normally. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you very much for coming on, guys. Yes, it's it's been very, very fun. Um, have you so got much. anything Thanks. exciting coming up or anything you want to say? Not like to us, but to the cameras, to the people of the nation that adore you so much. Well, we are no still raising money for Alzheimer's. If anybody wants to get in our Instagram oh, account, we've just done the um, Complete It Tough Mother yeah. and it was Amazing. our second time, second time. Um, yeah. for mm -hmm. Alzheimer's research because mm -hmm. we lost yeah. my dad to that awful disease. So oh. if anybody wants to yeah. contribute, that'd be fantastic. Perfect. We're nearly at our target, just Amazing. a couple of hundred off. Well, goodbye, first of all. Oh, but, um, <laughs> Bye. But always Bye, remember, then. listen and watch new episodes every Wednesday. And if you're in need of advice or even just have a question or story that you are desperate for me and mum to read, slide into the DMs on socials at Mummy's Boy Pod or give me a message on WhatsApp on 07822 013 And no matter what the issue, I will ask her. Goodbye. Bye. It's mommy's boy